L. How y'all be? There we go. Um, excuse the chair again. So my question is, is how'd y'all like the uh, last video? I think it's the last video. I don't know. How'd y'all like my um, ASMR? <laughs> I'm not perfect, but I tried. Hey, I tried. I think it was pretty good. Even if nobody else liked it, I'll, make it, I'll, I'll put it as private and I'll use it for myself. It actually made me fall asleep because it was so relaxing. It wasn't that it was boring at all. It was just that it was very, very relaxing. Okay, the reason why I brought you in to do this part is because this is pretty cool and I thought I'd bring y'all in let y'all see what I'm doing. So, so far what I've done, and this is the uh, Martha Stewart one I had. I got it from the resale store. That's the price I paid. Which is a pretty good deal. That's what it looks like. It's got the wings. Anyways, that's how you make these. I really like this. I think this is one of the best buys I've found so far. I think my husband found that one. I'm not sure. Anyways, I cut this. This is just that cardstock that goes inside the... What do you call them? The uh, scrapbooks. The original scrapbooking. Uh, it had the, the binder holes in it. Let's see if I can find it. Again, use the chair. It had these and I cut them off of it. Okay. Yeah. So I cut them off and I estimated how long I needed to be and how wide in order to make a pocket. And as you can see, it kind of cut off. It should be like this because of the length of it. It ended up cutting a tip off. That's fine. I'm going to try and do something with that. And I have all these things I need to glue down. These are extended pages. I haven't done that yet with y'all. But I'm doing this, and I thought, why not? So, okay. I gotta glue. I'm not gonna glue this down to this pocket. I'm gonna glue it in a U shape around, and then up through here. And then all these little things is gonna be glued together. They're gonna be glued together so that they don't move around. Anyways, and this is just a little uh, plastic thing that I always use. So, okay. So first of all, this is time consuming. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this and then this will be done. And then we'll put it on there, okay? Okie dokie. Yeah. So while I'm doing that, I'm just gonna say how y'all doing. I hope y'all doing fine. Again, I hope y'all liked that last. <laughs> I don't think it's the last video for y'all, but it was my last video that I have, you know, uploaded as of today, I mean. It was my last video that I uploaded. That's how old this, how ahead I am with my videos sometimes. Not always, but sometimes. And we have to do that in order to, when we want, like emergencies, like what happened here at our house with the AC. Whoop. So we have to get ahead of the game, you know. Um, just this is the time consuming part. If you want to fast forward it, you can. This will take a little bit. Probably going to get off camera on y'all too. I don't want it to get on my book. I do need to get started. I've been thinking about making a new book. Thinking about making a poll on my community tab for something. I know that a lot of people did, not a lot, what am I saying? Um, hang on, my mind is concentrating, making sure I don't go and lose glue all over the place. Now, I'm just gonna make the U shape, meaning I'm gonna go straight down if I can get it to stay on there, my hand and the tip, just like that. And this is going to be on the top, so the top here is going to be open right here. So we're just going to make a line down this side. And then down this part here. Okay, I know I was in mid-thought. <laughs> now I'm just going to try and get this on here. And all I did with the bottom one was use stick glue to glue it onto the tab for the closure of the envelope because that's an envelope underneath there we go and I don't, do i have one yes i do i have a dry one y'all 
I usually don't do dry ones because to me mine just leaves this like see it's already doing it Ugh, and I can't let that stick to that too much so it'll come up and then I go across the bottom here before that glue dries it's trying to dry already I'm trying to stay focused and I'm trying to talk about something here Anyways, what I was trying to say is I'm thinking about making a uh, new journal, and I thought I'd let y'all in on it. You know, tell me what y'all would like to see me make next. Just make sure it's something it's something that I would actually work with. I have to. I think I'm gonna have to shorten that piece because it's just a little too long. It's sticking down in there, and I don't like that. I have to pull that off there because it's getting on my nerves. Getting on my nerves. See, it's sticking back up. I don't know. I think I waited too long. Okay, you're going to have to get out of my way thing. Getting on my nerves. Okay, time to go underneath again. I think I'm going to put two lines of glue. One there and one further down it. And then hold that down, if at all possible. <laughs> so, what would y'all like to see in the next um, for the next journal? These are not for sale. These are just me working. And I know that y'all like some some. I don't know about all, but um, like my journals that I make. You know, my themed ones, like the mermaid and the. Red Dead Redemption one, which is uh, Arthur Morgan's journal. If you didn't know that, I made one of those. Yes, I drew the pictures myself. I'm out of breath. Um, let's see. Molly Weasley. I did one of hers because I loved her character in Harry Potter. Because she just reminds me a lot of me. Um, what else? Let's see. I'm trying to remember. I did a gypsy journal as well. Um, just, you know, everybody likes the, especially, everybody likes the, the two that's the favorite. Um, in the junk journaling world anyways that we do, uh, is the mermaid is top one, and then it's the gypsy one is the second one. Um, in the, like, if you want to go gaming aspect, uh, uh, the younger generation, they all pick the Arthur Morgan. And I say that because of I see how many likes and how many views it gets. That's how it helps me to know what is very, like, trendable. Like, what is very noticeable by people. Even though I don't get likes on my videos that I should get. Uh, that's why I turned them off again. Because I wasn't getting any. And if you don't get likes, then you don't want them on. You know? So, just saying. I'm not trying to be a butthead or anything, but may have to redo the bottom as well. I think I got that to stay. So anyways, my question is for those that watch my channel, at least the 30 something that what that tends to visit my channel and watch the videos, um, what is your preference of not videos now? Cuz I already know what y'all like. Y'all like something I can't afford and that's going to the resale store. Sorry, but these are the hard times. If you want to donate, I have a donate spot on my website. You can check that out. It's on the very front page. All you have to do is click that and it'll take you to a um, PayPal account that I have it connected to. And you can donate there. I only use PayPal for donate. That's it. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, PayPal has burnt a lot of us artists, you know, so we don't really care to work with them anymore except for, for donations, and even then, I just have the account, so I figured why not, you know, why not put them to use over there. Now, I might have to go over those, and they might dry clear, I don't know, we'll have to wait and see, hopefully they do. 
if these dry clear where their glue is, I'll go over them um, if they don't. In other words, I'll take a marker and go over those spots, but hopefully they'll dry clear and I won't see them. But what this is, the reason why I did this, is because this, again, hopefully that'll dry correctly. You can, see, you can see the white on there still. But as you can see, it's real pretty this way. Now I am going to close that up. I'm going to, make, I'm going to do another one of these and I'm going to put it here. So it'll close those together so they won't be you know, messed up. This is an opening here, you can journal here, there's a pocket here. I'm thinking about putting a, another piece of green paper here so that uh, we can write there, me and my niece. Open it up and this is another one. It's just like this one. The only thing is I put the thing down here. And then you can we can write here as well. But I do like this, this little setup here. I think that looks so pretty. Yeah. And then I plan on putting a horse here. A picture of horse, which I have right here. I can find it. I'm going to put that one right there on that. Because this is my sister's journal. See. Uh, this, if you don't know what this is, this is a memory journal. This is a memory book of, about my sister. I will write memories in here and my niece will write. My daughter, I'm going to ask her if she wants to add anything to it. And if my son is still watching, because he used to have my channel connected to him. Uh, if you're watching and you want to add something to your Aunt Sissy that you seem to love a lot, you know, you can send me that and I'll add it to the journal. Yeah. And to any other family members that might be watching, if you have anything you'd like to add to the journal, let me know. Anyways, this is going to go here. So i got to cut that out. These are my art pieces here. This is a piece that I seen on another website and I thought it was real pretty. This is not for sale, so it's not, it should not be a big deal. Okay, it does end right there, so it's going to be good. I just have to make sure that's going to... I should have done it with a black background, like a border around it. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to go ahead and glue that down. So I'm going to pop that up there out of my way. Anyways, uh, this is a fish that my sister loved that she called Charlie. It was a beta fish that she had. And um, I drew the fish because I used to have beta fish myself. And this is a piece that's really big that my sister had still. Um, he said her, her husband uh, said he was going to give it to, back to me so that I could have that. And I'm going to put that away. But yeah, uh, this is the little piece that I was going to use as a like a card in there. This one is a picture for a friend of my husband that he works with. Uh, that's her horse, and my sister loved horses. It didn't matter whose it was, and I thought I'd print that picture out and put that in here as another journal card of artwork that I've done. Even though it's not for my sister, but it's because she loves horses. Loved, loved horses. <laughs> she loved them. <laughs> so... Just thought I'd throw that out there. I'm going to cut that right below that one. I don't care for these, the way they turned out. This one's okay. This one's alright. But this one didn't turn out very well. So, it's too dark and I didn't like that. That's okay. I can fix it later. I'm not writing you. I'm trying to give this a frame. Right about there. Yeah. Unfortunately, it's a white frame. I wanted it to be a little bit darker frame. So they finally, I finally got my house back, y'all. Um, yeah. Those workers are no longer here. Thank goodness. And now I can relax again. Oh, y'all don't know what happened. I'm sorry. Well, I mean, y'all do know what happened, but I mean, you don't know what happened to me. Uh, dealing with that. If you don't know me, I have complex PTSD and I have been really distraught, like nerve wracked that there's people in my little bubble. <laughs> this is my little safe haven. And yeah. Yeah, that should fit now. And to have people in my house was really hard on me. 
They understood, because I wouldn't even open the door this morning. They should have finished Friday, but they didn't. That's okay. They're finished now. <laughs> okay, so this way, this can be turned into a pocket as well. So I could go this way or this way. So see as how this one here is a pocket up here. See, I'm going to show you. Let's see if I can stick this in there. This is a pocket. Yeah, it's too big. So there's a pocket here. Let me get a piece of paper. Make this size so you can see what I'm doing. There's a pocket here that opens on the top. And when you open it, see, it's inside there. And that's just from this envelope. This is an envelope. They call it craft uh, paper. It's a craft paper kind of envelope. It's two of them put together this side. And over here, this is just one of them's flap that closes the, you know, you lick it and then you close the envelope. That's what this is connected to. i got to be careful. I'm going to end up bending those. But this one right here, that's what this is. The other one I cut down and it's only barely in the other envelope. So it's hard to explain. I already showed how to do that, but yeah. That's what that is. So now I'm going to glue this to here and I'm just, uh, I'm going to go this way because the other one's like I said that way. So I'm just going to do a U shape on this one. Just like this. Started watching a new series on HBO because we have HBO and I didn't know. Well, I mean, I knew it, but I didn't, I've never really messed with TV. Never been a TV fan, you know. Well, I have been in the past. I just quit watching TV because it's just too many commercials and I hate commercials. Can't stand them. I don't know if y'all notice there is no commercials on my channel here. That's why. So anyways, um, what was I saying? <laughs> I forget what I was saying. Oh, I found a new uh, TV series. It's called Jamestown, I think. It's an old-fashioned uh, it's back in the, like, the starting of the, the, the American colony, I guess, or whatever, of America. I don't know. Uh, but yeah. So far, it's pretty good. I like it. Put a little bit of the glue on there. Okay, so this way is the pocket. This is glued all the way around here. Always remember, when wherever you want your pocket, put your finger there so that you don't glue there. That's how I make sure that I don't glue in that spot. <laughs> but yeah. Okay, and I need to make one of these for right here. See, I just bent it. <laughs> so, okay, let me do that right now. And I also need to go grab some green. I also got it over here. Oh, I think I have a piece of green, but it's too, it's too stiff. I need that kind of green. Oh my goodness, I'm getting old. Had to yank it. <laughs> I have tons of this kind of paper. Tons and tons of it. Okay. So from there to... Yeah, I started watching it last night. I've binge watched a lot of it. I call it a lot of it. I'm pretty sure it's only the first, the first uh, season. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. Why is that this out right now? Okay, that's where. Okay, so this is the piece that flaps down. This, this is the trans. Okay. Oh, I've already got it rounded, too. I can just round it again. It's no big deal. Don't want to take too much off. There we go. Hopefully that'll be enough for now. And then I'll have to re-round that off. I just don't like real violent movies, and I don't like naughty, you know, like, very, you know what I mean? Those kind of movies. I don't really care for movies that show a lot of 
body parts if you get my drift. And I don't mean gore. That too. I used to can handle all that stuff, but now I can't. He does something to me. Just hmm. gives me the heebie-jeebies. <laughs> Sounds like I'm talking about a movie I used to watch. Anyway. Okay, now I'm going to glue that down with stick glue. That'll give me another place to write, and it'll all bring, bring it, it brings it together. And this side, there's no green on it except for the, the bushy stuff. That's fine. Okay, so now I need to glue on that. This is an old text block. <laughs> Been using it for a while now. It's from, uh, I think, like an old school book, maybe. Kind of, sort of. Maybe a college one or something. When I push too hard because then it curls the glue, makes it glob. Anyways, while I was watching that video of mine on, um, what do we call it, uh, AS, A, ASMR, I always get it messed up. I almost spelt it wrong on there too. Um, while I was watching it, I did notice one thing. I enjoyed it a lot, and I noticed me not talking was a lot of the enjoyable part. So if y'all, I, I know there's a lot of lot of mixed feelings on that. A lot of people like to hear me talking because it gives them someone to hear in the background, and some people don't like hearing me talk. And they always tell me it's nothing to do with my voice and how it sounds. They actually, I'm told many times that I actually have a good voice. Um, for a person that used to smoke anyways. I don't smoke anymore. I haven't smoked a cigarette in three years now. I quit smoking March 10th, 2020. And it wasn't because of what, you know, the epizootie and all that stuff. It wasn't because of that. I just felt it was time. <sighs> So, anyway, there we go. That's good. So, anyways, I was sitting there saying to myself, I was watching, I was like, wow, man, this is very relaxing, you know, for the quietness, and all I hear is the crinkling of the paper, and the, the clicking, clicking from the scissors, or whatever, you know, just, it was very relaxing. I don't know if anybody else liked it, but I did. And that's what matters too, you know, because if y'all don't really care for it, I'll keep it to myself and use it for myself then, you know. Okay, now where is, do I have any more of that paper? What color is that black? Okay, that's black. This is what I need because this is what color that one is. Hopefully I have enough time to show you this, which I already showed y'all many, 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 many times. This is just a two inch hole punch. And get it right there and then see if I got enough room to get a second one which I do that way I'm not wasting that and this one gets put over here out of the way and this is the one I'm going to use I'll need my little hole puncher put that one back in there because I don't need it anymore and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fold this straight in half I can get it to fold. <laughs> I'm trying to remember what I did with the original that I started with because I need it as a template. I don't see it up there. Okay, gotta fold this perfectly in half. I know there's something there. The cutter's getting dull, I guess, now. Okay. See, did I put it in here? Hmm. Hmm. I don't know what I did with it, so I guess I'll just have to wing it. I wanted it to look just like the other one, but I don't know what happened to the other one. Oh well. Okay. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and 
snip this one. Wait a second. Okay, there it is. There's this one. At least I can use this to do what I need to do. To get the perfect shape that I need it to be to match the other one. It moved. I should have known. Still moving on me. Okay, this may not work that way. I'm just gonna have to wing it. So what I'm gonna do is take off one of the corners, get that out of there. Take that corner, put it upside this, so I'll know that it's the right way when I do this. Okay, it goes this way. I do believe, just like that. So I'm gonna take it and just bring it, flip it this way. Like flip it over to this side, get it right there beside of it. I want it to be perfect. That's the reason why you don't have to if you don't want to. This is how I get my well tails that I like, and then I just do that so I know right where to go. And then I take this and go right around, right along that that line that I just created. Can't get it perfect. There we go. Okay, we got it so far like this. So now you can use this, which is what I did on those, I do believe. And that is just take the little tips here off by just going right on the edge, going at an angle toward it, you know. Try and keep them about the same. And there we go. Can you see it? That's how I do it. Now this one's going to go right here on that spot to help hide the fact that that's not a full-fledged one, like this one is down here. And I want to make sure it's the same height as the other one is, bringing it down. Even if it covers over some of the little holes, say right about there is good. So now I just need to put glue on her. Okay. See me being quieter? See how, see how much calmer it is for you. But I can't be quiet. That's the problem. <laughs> I seriously can't. I like talking too much. I don't know if it's just because I'm always, you know, in my house, never getting around people, so I automatically want to jibber jabber a lot, you know, talk your ears off kind of thing. You know? I don't know if that's the reason why. More likely it is. Yeah, this one's a little bit bigger than that side. Not a big deal. There we go. Now what I can do to even emphasize this more, which I don't have the time to do, but I can take a little gold embellishing rub stuff, you know, like, let's see if I can reach them. Oh, I can't reach it hardly. There we go. This is the gold this is just that stuff you can buy from uh, Hobby Lobby in the little tubes. I just stick it in these, see, and and it's just a rub stuff. That's all it is. And all I have to do is just put my finger right here on the edge. See, it's on your finger there. I just kind of like, you know, rub it on stuff, whatever. I'm not sure if I want to yet, so I'm just going to wait about that because I know it'll rub off on the other parts of it, on the other edges and stuff. So, so anyways, um, I guess that's it. Hope y'all enjoyed this. <laughs> and if you did, uh, give me a like. I know you can't see them, but it does help our channel still yet. Even if you can't see them, it helps me. Um, comment. That really helps. And if you have any comments, questions, or anything like that, requests or anything like that, leave it in the comments. Any information you want to know, like my well, website, um, you know, Facebook, or whatever I have on there. I forget now. My brain's blank right now. 
anyways if you have any questions about that you can find the that stuff in there and you can leave the request in my comments area if you have any questions give everyone a chance to answer that question more than likely i will answer you back because i do love doing that and i'm fixing it cut off so i thank y'all all for watching be sure to subscribe hit the bell notification bye y'all